Hello everybody, I'm posting this video in a very critical time for Boris Johnson. I was actually up all night, I didn't sleep very well. Thinking of this, I came down in the middle of the night to check on his Monica planets. Monica means death producing planet. So on this video, I'm going to go into a place I'm very daring to go into. Not many ast astrologers want to go there. I'm feeling quite nervous making this video everybody because I've been very upset about it and I'm feeling quite tearful making this video because obviously I wish the very best for our Prime Minister. So on the video that I made in August, everybody, I talked about the eclipse cycle happening in Boris Johnson's chart in December. And I said in August that December would be the turning point, would turn everything around 360 for him. But I was only talking about politics. I was not talking about his health or his personal um condition or his relationships. I would never go there. It's not what I would normally do. I was just talking about it turning around everything for him 360 degrees, which it did. But actually in the middle of that video, I talked about that Saturn Dyer would destabilize him terribly and it was going to begin in January 2020 for two and a half years and that would impact our country as well. Why? Moon is the most important planet to look at for health and for well-being. Fourth from his moon, Saturn is now there for two and a half years, called Saturn Dia. It is like a mini Sadi Sati. It's a dangerous time for anybody. And as he is our, our prime minister, it's our country too. Saturn Dia is dangerous for health relationships and home life can be turned upside down at that time. So it's very churning. Anybody goes through Saturn Dyer, it's a very churning and dangerous situation. But that's not enough to put him in this critical position. We have to look at Monica planets, death producing planets. It's quite hard to talk about these things, as I say. But let me do it because only in the Vedic system can we see Marika planets. Let me tell you, I had my Marika Mahadasha, which was an app Makarika for me as well in the last so many years. In fact, two years ago, I was in that Marika position myself. I didn't die. Here I am now. But I did have a huge accident which totaled my career. So Monica can be death or it can give you death producing circumstance. So where is Monica happening for Boris Johnson? Let's see. Let's consider Monica planet from the sun, moon, ascendant. For Boris Johnson from the sun, it is moon and Jupiter, neither of which are really influencing him at this moment. From his ascendant, it is Venus and again, Jupiter. Venus is his bukti. This is hugely what is happening now. So Venus is the Monica impacting him. From his uh, moon sign, it is Mars and Mars. So Mars isn't directly influencing now, only indirectly as it is with his Mahadasha planet. So, so to summarize, Boris is in a Marika Bukti planet, which is eclipsed by Rahu. And with the sun, which is, of course, his life itself, it is combust the sun. I actually pointed that out on a recent video I actually posted last week that he, he is actually in his Atmakarika Mahadasha, which is hugely dangerous as the highest degree planet. And I said in a very fast way that... Venus was not looking good for him either. So it isn't looking auspicious at this time for Boris Johnson. It's a critically dangerous position. Can I finally point out to you something that you may not know about Boris Johnson? Um, he is in a very dangerous Monica position. But don't forget, Monica does not always kill everybody. You can survive Monica. And don't forget, everybody only survives any danger by the grace of God. By the absolute grace of God, people pull through enormous danger. And Boris Johnson, actually, I don't know whether you know everybody, but he visited a um, Hindu temple outside London in December, a very beautiful temple where he had darshan of 
um, Radha Krishna and actually Sita Ram Lakshman Hanuman. And tomorrow, the 8th of April, is Hanuman's appearance day. I will post below the video Hanuman Chalisa. Very auspicious for everybody to hear, anybody who is in danger to hear. 8 is, of course, a dangerous Saturn day for everybody and will be so for Boris Johnson. It will probably be a critical day for him. That is... April the 8th. So I'm very much praying with all my heart for him posting Hanuman Chalisa and indeed I will post another very beautiful and famous Vedic mantra which gives all protection in dangerous situations. So with that in mind I say God bless everybody and indeed Boris Johnson and goodbye for now.